I'm Betsy Schramm. I'm eighth grade math at Meadowbrook Middle School. Students are learning about rate of change and slope. They need to be able to look at a table, find the rate of change between the x and the y variable, and then look at a graph and be able to determine the rate of change from the graph, which they can use the rise over run to find that, and then also be able to use the slope formula from given two points. They're using Show Me to basically do all three of those things, to create a table, a graph, and use the slope formula to show me the rate of change by creating their own problem. So they create their own problem um, about a real life situation, such as how much money it would cost to buy one item, how much money it would cost to buy two items that would have a constant rate of change. And then they're showing me that on a table graph, which they can take a picture of and insert it. And then they're able to write on there. The main part of using Show Me is that after they do all their work, they have to go back and voice over telling me exactly what they did on each of their three parts and just letting me know how they understand. At first, some of the students were hesitant to record themselves. They didn't want to have to talk and explain what they were doing, but to reach those higher DOK levels, they have to explain their strategy and why they understand what's going on. The time it took me to eat 20 pickles took me one hour, and the time that took me to eat 40 pickles took me two hours, and then when I ate 60 pickles, it took me three hours. Rise over run. Where, when I went to 20 to 40, I added 20, so 20, and I moved over 1, so 20 over 1 is a rise over 1. 80 minus 40 equals 20, 4 minus 2 equals 1, and 20 over 1 can be reduced to 20. Um, I learned a lot from this, and I thought it was a good way to be able to see the students work out all their problems and explain it to me, and I plan on using it again.